theater, I say let's do a play. Using our imagination, as well as a good enunciation, together we will be creating a creation that will take your breath away. Is a stage by friend. Attend and hark if you've an ear to lend. We're gonna tell a tale with once upon a time at the start, and there's a happily ever after at the end. Say, Mr. Smythe. Yes, Mr. Joe. What story shall we players play today? I say we commence with an icebreaker. Our voice is flowing in a fantastic flurry. As we feature the fabulous fable of Frozen. Frozen. It's a very special tale of two very special girls. They're full of hopes and dreams, a little something like you. And if they put some work into it, make their minds up to pursue it, they can make their wish come true. It may be awfully hard to do, but with imagination, some courage and determination, if they can conquer all their fears and trepidation, then they just might make it through. For all the world is a stage, my friend. Attend and hark if you've an ear to lend. Here's one thing on which you can. A little chronicle of courage and heart. We're gonna tell a tale with once upon a time at the start. There's a happily ever after at the end. Happily ever after at the end. <laughs> Thank you very Thank much. Thank you very much. You are most kind, and I believe we have time for an encore. Sir Samuel. <laughs> An encore? Yes! But we haven't even played the play! But what is it you always say? Right, but first we have to catch the monkey. No, no, uh, the other thing you always say. <laughs> Give them what they want. Give them what they want? Yes, and what they want is an encore. They want us to sing that song! What song? What song? That song! What? The song? The song that launched a thousand ships. The song which, by any other name, would sound as sweet. Come, uh, Mr. Smythe. Let us invoke the Utopian Muse and sing that song! Oh, that song? But what about our story? What is it you always say? Give them what they want. No, no, the other thing you always say. Leave them wanting more. Leave them wanting more? Yes, so we'll give them what they want. The song. And leave them wanting more. The story! Precisely! Shall we have a huzzah? Huzzah! Lords and ladies, for your auditory amusement, we present the song. <laughs> Powerful, dangerous, cold. The ice has a magic can be controlled. Stronger than one, stronger than ten, stronger than a hundred men. Ha! Huzzah! I love that song. I love all the songs. So, did we leave you wanting more? Then let's give them what they want. Lords and ladies, let the play. Begin. Once upon a time, in a faraway kingdom called Arendelle, there lived two sisters born into a royal family. The oldest was named Elsa, and the youngest was named Anna. Growing up in the castle, the two girls loved to play together. Do you want to build a snowman? Okay. Do the magic! Do the magic! Even as a child, Elsa possessed magical powers that enabled her to create ice and snow with the wave of her hand. Using his 
his magical troll, troll magic, Poppy the magic troll, magically healed young Anna, as well as removing all memories of Elsa's magical powers. He also warned Elsa, your power will only grow. There is beauty in it, but also great danger. You must learn to control it. Fear will be your enemy. Fear leads to anger. Anger leads to hate. And hate leads to suffering. <laughs> Determined never to hurt her sister again, Elsa kept herself locked away from Anna, allowing her fear to overpower the great love she felt for her sister. Elsa, please, I know you're in there. Go away. <laughs> knock, knock. Who's there? Anna. Anna who? Anna one, Anna two, Anna three. Do you want to build a snowman? <laughs> Come on, let's go and play. Whee! I never see you anymore. Come out the door. It's like you've gone away. Hey! We used to be best buddies, and now we're not. I wish you would tell me why. Do you want to build a snowman? It doesn't have to be a snowman. Go away, Anna. Okay, bye. The years passed, and finally the day arrived when Elsa was to be crowned queen. Which means it's time to introduce two very special guests. Lords and ladies, to help us regale you with the regal regality. Our two royally royal royals. Please welcome Queen Elsa and Princess Anna. Hi there, Princess Anna. Hi, Mr. Jones. Thank you so much for joining us today. Well, we wouldn't miss it. Now you understand how all of this works. Together we shall tell your tale, reenacting dramatic moments along the way. You play you. And you play you. And we'll play everybody else. That sounds amazing. Huzzah! Then let the play... Continue. <laughs> Day was a glorious occasion for all of Arendelle. It seemed like the first time in forever that the doors of the castle were open. I couldn't wait to go outside. Because for the first time in forever, there'll be magic, there'll be fun. For the first time in forever, you could be noticed by someone. Oh, <laughs> hello. Hi. You must be the princess. I am. I mean, yes, I am. My lady, Prince Hans of the Southern Isles. Wow, you're so... Handsome. That's what I was gonna say. And you're so... Hungry. That's what I was gonna say. Wow, yeah, this feeling is like, like nothing I've ever known before. before. Can I say something crazy? Will you marry me? Can I say something crazier? Yes! Can I say something even crazier? <laughs> With that, they rushed to the coronation ball to share the news of their engagement. Your Majesty, if I may ease your mind. No, you may not. The party is over. Close the gates. Elsa, please. I can't live like this anymore. Then leave. What did I ever do to you? Enough, Anna. I'm just trying to protect you. What are you so afraid of? I said enough. <gasps> Sorcery! Queen Elsa is a monster. She's a witch. Burn her! Elsa, stay away from me. Come back. Don't follow me. Elsa flew across the fjord in a furious frenzy, freezing everything as she fled. Hans, I must go after her. No, it's too dangerous. Elsa's not dangerous. She's my sister. She loves me. I'm coming with you. No, I need you to stay here and take care of Arendelle. I leave Prince Hans in charge. As you wish.
determined to help her sister on a pursuit Elsa. Slogging through the snowy landscape, she soon encountered a rugged but sensitive ice merchant named Krista. Uh, excuse me? <laughs> Who are you? I'm a rugged but sensitive ice merchant named Kristoff. <laughs> and this is my trusty sidekick, Sven. He's a reindeer. I'm a trusty sidekick, Sven! I'm a reindeer! <laughs> oh, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Kristoff, <laughs> uh, well, Sven, I need you to take me to the North Mountain. I don't take people places. But you'll die on your own! I know how to stop this winter. Please, I need to make this right. We leave at dawn. We leave at dawn. Good, so we leave now. Right now? Well, here comes my sled. Hop in. Do not pull down on the safety bar, please. I will lower it for you. <laughs> Hang on, we like to go fast. Yeah! Yeah! So, what made the green go all ice crazy? Oh, well, it was all my fault. I got engaged and she freaked out because I'd only just met him, you know, that day. And... Wait, you got engaged to someone you just met? Yeah. Anyway, so then I got mad and she got mad and she tried to walk away. Hang and on. I... You mean to tell me you got engaged to someone you just met? Yeah. Anyway, so the thing is... I... Wait. What? I've got a bad feeling about this. Sled made the castle run in less than 12 seconds. <laughs> Ice cream. <laughs> this special report is brought to you 
by Frosted Luna Fist Crunchies. A breakfast cereal that makes you wish it was lunchtime. Now available in bulk at One Ring Oak's Trading Post and Sauna. <laughs> we now return to our play already in progress. Elsa, you kind of set off an eternal winter, but it's okay. You could just unfreeze it. I can't. I don't know how. Sure you can. I know you can. I can't control the curse. I can work this out. Anna, please. I don't want to hurt you. Everything will be alright. Anna, no! Oh, oh no! Oh, Anna! We've got to get you help before you freeze to death. I know. How about a warm hug? No! The magic trolls. Oh! is in danger. There was ice in your heart put there by your sister. If not removed to solid ice, will you freeze forever? Can't you remove it? Oh, alas, I cannot. Only an act of true love can thaw a frozen heart. An act of true love. A true love's kiss. Oh, and her true love is... Hans. Hans? Hans. Who's Hans? <laughs> Quick, we've got to get you back to Arendelle. Race back to the castle as the winter weather worsened. And while it was difficult for Kristoff to say goodbye, he knew he had no choice. To save Anna, he had to leave her with her true love, Hans. Kristoff, Hans, you have to kiss me. What happened out there? Uh, Elsa struck me with her powers. She froze my heart, and only an act of true love can save me. A true love's kiss? Oh, Anna. If only there was someone who loved you. What? Oh, sweet, innocent Anna. You see, my only hope to rule a kingdom was to marry into the throne. I figured after our wedding, I'd stage a little accident for Elsa. Hans, no! I followed you up the North Mountain and captured Elsa. She's in a prison cell right now. And all that's left is for me to kill Elsa and bring back Summer. You're no match for Elsa. <laughs> no, you're no match for Elsa. I, on the other hand, am a hero that's going to save Arendelle from destruction. You won't get away with this. Oh, I already have. <laughs> Anna was fading fast when Olaf found her, trying to stay warm by the fireplace. Olaf? <gasps> What happened with your kiss with Hans? <laughs> I was wrong about him. It wasn't true love. Well, then we need to find some other act of true love to save you. <laughs> Any ideas? I don't even know what love is. I'm so sorry. <laughs> love is never having to say you're sorry. Oh, it's no. putting someone else's needs before your own. You, you know how Kristoff brought you back here to Hans and left you forever. Oh! Kristoff loves me? Wow! You really don't know anything about true love, do you? Oh, look out! You're melting! <laughs> I'm melting! <laughs> You know, Anna, some people are worth melting for. <laughs> Come on, let's go find Kristoff! <laughs> Elsa, your winter's tale has come to an end. Prepare to die! Great Scott, she's escaped!
there's only one way this is going to end. No! Anna? Anna? Oh, Anna! I'm so sorry! Oh, no. And then... A magical thing happened. The storm ceased. The ice began to melt, and two hearts were released from their icy spell. The act of true love wasn't a kiss at all, but Anna's selfless sacrifice to save her sister. And Elsa learned that love, not fear, should govern her powers. The sisters reunited. reunited. The castle was restored, and Summer was brought back more beautiful than ever! And they all lived. And I believe we have time for an encore. Yes, indeed. Let's give them what they want. You mean the song? Yes, that song. Lords and ladies, we invite you all to sing along. My power flurries through the air into the ground. My soul is spiraling in frozen fractals all around. And one thought crystallizes like an icy blast. I'm never going back. The past is in the past. Sing it loud and let it go. Let it go. And I'll rise like the break of dawn.